remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? Due to the coronavirus pandemic, airlines are canceling flights, Airbnbs are refunding money, schools and universities are shutting down all over the world, major music festivals and events are being canceled or postponed, and now the National Basketball Association is having their moment of reckoning. On Wednesday, Utah Jazz Center Rudy Gobert tested positive for COVID-19. Within minutes, the league has suspended the season and the sports world was getting a lesson in the dangers of the coronavirus. At least one other league is mulling the possibility of doing the same. The moment also made Gobert a significant figure in NBA history and a person the world will likely learn more about in the days coming. Why is that? Well, you see, what had happened is, following practice on Monday, Rudy reacted to news that the NBA was closing its locker rooms to the media amid fears of the virus by touching each reporter's microphone. He just reached out on the table and just did that. And that was a few chuckles, a little laughter here and there. He walked off. Ain't so funny now, because Rudy is positive, COVID-19 positive. This is what I was saying earlier, people laughing. I mean, like I say, people laughed about AIDS because they, they thought they were foreign to it. They thought that it was something that could not happen to them. A report said the incubation time for most is 2 to 14 days, with 5 being the average. So that means that Rudy already had the virus when he touched those microphones. Microphones that those reporters touched afterwards. Then you got to consider that he came in contact with other people. And those reporters came in contact with a lot of people, touching stuff. And what about basketball practice? He had it, and he was passing that ball around to all of those players. They all got to get tested. Their family members have to be tested. Their friends have to be tested. This thing is spreading like wildfire. Y'all nervous yet? You think it's serious yet? Eh, I know, I know you're always going to have a couple of holdouts, you know, like, damn it, I don't give a damn. Just, come on with it. Come on, give a damn. Man, y'all tripping, y'all faking it. Yeah. Hey, man, do what makes you sleep good. But I know one thing, you better be careful out there. Don't think just because most people who are dying or old or sickly don't mean that you can't be an exception if you're young and healthy and strong. We don't know the full effects of this virus yet. Yeah, it was funny, all right, but not in the way he intended. You know what's ironic? Rudy rubbed the mic, but coronavirus dropped the mic. No more talk. What the haters talking about?